definitely two of the guys that we've watched each other through various points in our careers. But um, yeah, I mean, we all kind of know each other because we are all at the same conventions together. So. You mentioned uh, art prom and book club. What were some of your other influences? Um, I mean, uh, most of my biggest influences don't really come from comic books. Uh, I mean, Steve Ditko was a huge influence on me because those were the only comics I could get. Uh, Steve Ditko's Spider-Man. That was my first comic book I ever read. Um, uh, yeah, I don't know. I mean, Jim Henson was a really, really massive influence on me, as were a lot of the sort of demented 1970s children's shows. Kind of all that really weird. Does anybody remember the letter people? No? Yeah. YouTube that tonight, and you're welcome for the nightmares that you have. Um, Wow. Yeah, there was just a lot of disturbing stuff. And I remember watching, I mean, Heinz Edelman's designs for the Yellow Submarine was a really big influence on me because I remember, I don't know why that was constantly on when I was at my grandma's house. And that's not something that a kid should watch ever. It was just horrible for a, ch for a child to watch. But a lot of that kind of stuff, sort of the, uh, the aftermath of the 60s drug culture, I think, was a really big influence on me. So it was sort of that. And then I think a lot of the black and white comics of The New Yorker um, and Edward Gorey and stuff like that. So I'd say that's what was mainly influential to me. Well, I think that's a good note to stop on unless somebody has a last minute pressing question. Well, I, uh, be, I will be glad to sign this book or other books or whatever you have um, within reason. Uh, and yeah, stop on up and say hi. Thanks for coming by. I really appreciate it. So thanks.